Hello, how are you today? It is the final Wednesday of the month. It's also the final day of the month. So it's time for me to talk about my November favorites. I hope you've had a lovely November. I've had a good month. Uh, it's my birthday month. So November's just as a rule, one of my favorites out of the month. It was a nice month overall, lots of fun things going on. And I'm gonna talk about some of them today, starting predictably with TV shows. This month, the current series of The Great British Bake Off ended. I enjoyed this series mainly because I really liked the contestants this year, especially the ones in the final few. The challenges, however, definitely feel like they're getting harder and I feel like they should cut back on that next series. But yes, overall, it was a really good show and I really enjoyed watching it each week. But my favorite TV show this month is Andor, the Disney Plus series. I reviewed it at the weekend so you may already know my thoughts on the show but I loved it. My favourite out of the Star Wars shows so far. Looking forward to the next season. It was a really good addition to my month. Now on to some games. I'm going to start by briefly mentioning Fortnite. I haven't played a ton of Fortnite this month but I've played a little bit and I've played a little bit because there is now a mouse skin in Fortnite. I have been waiting for this moment since I started playing Fortnite all those years ago. It's a nice fun skin as well. It's really gonna take a lot to convince me to wear a different skin now because I feel like I have achieved my final form. There's also a mouse skin in Fall Guys so just generally at the moment I'm having the best time with video games. Also this month we finished Mass Effect 2 on stream. My favourite of the series so far. Really loved the story in this one and we've just started Mass Effect 3 so I'm looking forward to seeing how that compares. And my favourite game this month is Hearthstone. This is a digital collectible strategy card game and it's free to play so that's great. I completed Solitarica which is another strategy card game a few months back and I've been feeling the loss. I wanted a strategy card game in my life and Hearthstone has filled that space admirably. I have been playing a lot I really enjoy it. It's my sort of card game. There's quite a lot to think about when you're playing. And my favourite thing is that there are a fair amount of different modes. You can play solo adventures, which is kind of a story. You can play traditional Hearthstone, which is player versus player. There's another mode which I have just started playing in and love, but I'm not good at yet, called Battlegrounds, which is eight people playing against each other. There's also Mercenaries mode and Tavern Brawl and Arena and Duels. I haven't done any duels. You get the idea, there's quite a few modes, which I enjoy, but because sometimes you don't just want to you know play the same mode over and over again you want a bit of variety so that suits me very well and there are also challenges which also suits me very well because it's nice to have a bit of direction yeah really fun game mildly disappointed at myself for not playing it before now but better late than never and i am excited to progress now on to a place this doesn't feel like it was this month because it isn't it was at the end of october but it was since the last favourites video, so it's going in here. I returned to MCM Comic Con after a few years away. I only went for one day, but it was a really great day. I went with a friend. We mainly spent our time looking at all of the stores and experiences. We didn't go to any panels, but I bought some really nice things, including the thing that is my favourite purchase for this month. It is a teeny tiny wooden dice box in the shape of a sword. This was £25. It also came with little tiny dice, which is my favourite thing. I love tiny dice. I already have one set, so this is my second set of tiny dice. So yeah, I just really love this container so much. And finally, some presents, uh, which is only fitting for a birthday month. My favourite birthday present this year is this karaoke microphone. I've been seeing them a lot uh, over the last year or two, mainly in K-dramas, and it just looked like so much fun. Um, you know, it's Bluetooth, so you can put the, the karaoke song on your phone, it plays through the microphone, sing into the microphone, there's also lights happening, you can also distort your voice. It's just really fun. Recommend it as a relatively cheap pastime slash Christmas present. Hours of fun. And finally, something which is almost entirely out of shot right now, my mum made little mouse ears for my headset which I wear when I'm streaming on Twitch. So I've got little crocheted mouse ears on my headset. Aren't they the best? And they're also detachable, which is very practical. There's poppers on the back. So those are my favourite things from November. I can't wait till December. I'm really looking forward to Christmas, the new year, 
bit of time off work. But before then, I would love to know some of your favourite things from this month. And also, do you have any thoughts on any of the things I've talked about today? Thank you for watching this video, and let's move across to the end screen. If you'd like to see my latest video or some more favourites videos, then you can do that below me here. And if you'd like to subscribe to my channel or visit my website, then you can do that beside me here. And there's a link to my Patreon page in the description below if you fancy it. Have a fantastic day, have a great start to December, and I will see you soon.